Zomato CEO Dipinder Goel recently grabbed the spotlight by unveiling a service designed to cater specifically to vegetarian customers, which is the Pure Veg mode. Now, what is it and why did it stir controversy? Let's find out. I'm Shivangi and you're watching India TV. According to Goel, the Pure Veg mode featured a dedicated Pure Veg fleet, which meant that the delivery person, part of the fleet, would wear green attire and have green delivery boxes. Goel explained the necessity of establishing a separate fleet for vegetarian deliveries, citing instances where food spills resulted in the aroma lingering and affecting subsequent orders. But this whole idea created a lot of controversy. People took to social media platforms expressing fears about the safety of delivery personnel donned in green versus the traditional red. Critics argued that this move could exacerbate existing divides and lead to harassment for delivery personnel still sporting the traditional red shirts in neighborhoods that prioritize vegetarianism. Not only this, many pointed out mistakes at Goel's statistics, justifying the need for such a service. People shared data showing more than 50% of the Indian population identifying as non-vegetarian. The heat turned up when Congress MP Karti Chidambaram highlighted concerns over potential discrimination based on the personal dietary preferences of the delivery staff. Following this criticism, Dipinder Goel made a swift decision. Taking to social media platform X, Goel stated that while Zomato will continue with the pure veg mode, all riders, regardless of their assignment to the regular fleet or the pure wedge fleet, would continue wearing the red t-shirts. Therefore, as Zomato goes back to the drawing board, one thing is for sure, the customer's voice is powerful. But what do you think? Was this a step in the right direction or a misstep? Do comment and let us know. Till then, keep watching India TV.